Hello, this is your girl, Miss Brown Callie. I came on here to talk about those basketball wives. Ooh, wee, let's get started. Jennifer, Jennifer, Jennifer. Mm -mm -mm. Try to use your mama as your excuse for talking about Evelyn's daughter. Mm. But um, your mama hadn't died yet, huh? Sad, just sad. Just come clean. Everybody know you're lying. Just come clean about it. Mm. Are you really are some type of friend? And what about OG? What about this whole OG CC Kristen situation? I know some people may not agree with me. But this is how most women are. Most women are messy. Majority of women are messy. Let's just put it out there. More majority of women are messy. CC do not like confrontation. So she said, I'm just going to put the little secret out there. I'm going to let OG know. Because I know she don't like Kristen. And she going to tell it. She going to use this opportunity to throw it up in her face soon as she can. And that's what she did. Uh, and the whole thing about it was like, well, it's not really a secret. Everybody knows about it. Hey, I didn't know. <laughs> it was it, hey, it was news to me. I didn't know. But uh, I guess a whole lot of people didn't know. Um, but they, these women are something else. They hit below the belt. Kristen did keep picking, picking, picking. You know, my husband, my husband, you ain't got a husband. And that's how women are. That's how women are. You you keep coming for me. You keep pushing me and pushing me. And I'm going, hey, I'm going to come back after you. Now, I felt like Cece did it because you sent up here publicly insulting us, saying we're, hey, saying Byron's a terrible grandparent. And this is a way of saying, hey, well... Just not really even his child. Instead of just saying, you know, hey, we could have did better. You're right, we could have did better. But you could have went about this situation a whole lot better. You didn't have to. You could have just called and said, hey, Byron, what's up? What's going on? You could have picked up the phone. Kristen could have picked up the phone and talked to her father-in-law. You could have picked up the phone if you had an issue with what was going on. You could have did it. Everybody want to point the finger at everybody else. You could have took the initiative. You could have went over to this house. Hey, I'm coming over, y'all. What time? What's what's a good time to come over? Let's work this out. Let's y'all could have went about this a whole lot different. Instead, y'all just decided, hey, let's all be petty. So uh, I feel like Cece was like, well, you know, you want to try to say he's a bad grandparent. Well, this is really not his child anyway to begin with, which. It's not what you do. If you accept somebody as your child, you adopt this person, this your child, it's your child. Period. Don't matter who had them. So that's not the right way of going about it. Like, but y'all keep acting like CC Black. She not black. <laughs> she not black. She not gonna handle this like black people do. She not black. That's the bottom line. She just not black. She gonna handle it the way other races handle it. She she not a sister. Now, the whole thing about it is really messed up. Is I thought <laughs> Kristen, I don't know what the whole crying thing was about for. Like, what, what was that all about? What you cry for? I didn't get that part. Like, mm, why are you so emotional now? Like, you had so much to say all this other time. You so quick to talk to trash by everybody. You so quick to run back and tell everybody dirt. Oh, so-and-so said this, that. You so quick to run and tell everything. Now somebody done told something that you didn't want told. Hmm. Now you want to sit and try to cry. Pretend fight. Hmm. Come on, would you would have bust your butt. Come on, girl, girl, stop it. Stop, stop it. You, you know you're not. That was doing too much. So what I thought was really ironic about the whole situation is Shawnee sitting up there, you don't tell people secrets but y'all decided to air it. Y'all could have edited that out. Y'all didn't have to show the public that. But y'all said, mm, 
Now, this is just too juicy to not let the public know. So, hmm, I guess y'all really do tell people secrets. Y'all could have cut that out. Y'all didn't have to put that for the world to know. So y'all just say, hey, we, we, hey, we all going to tell the secret. It's out now. We all going to share it. So, yeah, that, that was interesting. But uh, these ladies are something else. They, they were doing way too much. And Malaysia is getting mad because Cece told it. Why y'all, <laughs> what did y'all think Cece's going to do? Cece's not going to confront nobody. She's not going to get into no physical confrontation. What do y'all think she was going to do? Y'all think she was just going to keep sitting back? Doo -doo 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 -doo. I'm not going to do anything. Come on. What, what do y'all think she was going to do? Y'all should have known she was going to do something underhanded. Like, mm. well, y'all wanted a response. Y'all got one. <laughs> she used OG. She played. She played her cards right. Real talk. Like, I know OG don't like Kristen. And I know OG. Let's, let's face it. Bottom line. Who better else? Like, I'm not going to fight her. But I know OG might swing on her. I know if it get, get a little out of hand, they could fight. So she let her do it. So... Byron didn't seem, Byron sounded like he was down with it too. Like, hmm, you already made me look bad. So, oh well. Not only did you make me look bad, but your husband co-signed on it. Like, hmm, he didn't even stand up to you. Like, you shouldn't have said that. Not once. He just sat there like, doo-doo-doo. He ain't say a word. He just sat there and was like, well, she's like, well, he hasn't. He, he didn't say, you, you know what? You shouldn't have said that. You, you need to apologize. We need to handle this a different way. This is not the way we need to go about the situation. Nobody corrected her. So, Byron was like, hey. Hey, so what? Cats out the bag now. Really ain't no secret. Everybody know. I guess it really wasn't no secret because Malaysia looks like, oops. Uh, we didn't know y'all was going to go there. Um, this whole thing about Tammy, um, with the hypnotize, getting hypnotized. Tammy, really? I'm not a smoker. My parents are smokers. Well, my father did quit. He had a heart attack. Uh, when he was laying up in that hospital, when he came out, that's made him stop. He went cold turkey. So I, I've never had that habit. So I don't know what that feels like. Um, but I do know they say that's a hard habit to kick. I wish her the best of luck because really you all those girls got. And I, you know, my grandmother, she's still here. I think she's, my grandma's about 83. She was a smoker. She kicked it cold turkey. And that's, the, that's the way they say you have to do it. You just have to, you just have to stop. Just mind over matter, I guess. I wish you the best of luck. That's all I can say about it. Hopefully, hopefully you can you you'll be able to handle it. But that hypnotized stuff, girl. I don't really think it works. And it didn't look like it worked. Um, what else? Yeah, the, everything else is pretty like mm, what Kristen did was uh, what what everybody did was come on. This is basketball wise. You you know somebody's secret is gonna get told. You know there's gonna be some type of almost altercation. Somebody almost gonna fight. They're gonna break it up. They ain't gonna let them fight. So that's to be expected. And yeah, you know, I hope everyone had a good fourth of July. I went out of town fourth of July and uh that's I'm a little late putting up this review. If you like my videos, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment. Thanks. Till the next one.